It's Girl Scout cookie time. Woo. All right, today, today's recipe is using one of the top selling cookies out there. Elizabeth Flat is a high school senior and a member of Girl Scout Troop 616. She's going to show us how to make a thin mint ice cream pie. That looks good right there. Good to have you with us today. Thank you. Yes. Doing all right? I'm doing wonderfully. Good, Thank good. You. All right. So tell me a little bit about what you're doing. Okay. So what we're doing is we're making the uh, thin mint ice cream pie. Okay. And the way you start it is by crushing up a box of thin mints, mm -hmm. mixing it with melted butter, and pressing that crust either into a spring form pan or a regular pie pan if you'd like. Okay. So once that's done, you add a layer of mint ice cream, you let mm -hmm. it soften, then you let that set for about an hour, which is what we've already done. Okay, already. Once that's finished, we add the second layer of crushed thin mints, which we So you just get now. some just, I, I hate that yeah. teacher. I hate that she gives me another <laughs> exam today. Oh. Is that what you did or something else? Well, you could also use a rolling pin. Oh, okay. I think works but this really is well. more fun. That though. is fun. That is definitely. Mama won't let me go out to that fun. party on Friday night. Oh. Okay, go ahead. Yes. So once you've crushed that with a rolling pin or your very ready fists. Okay. Um, you take that and you just scoop and you sprinkle that all across the top. Because when you can have more Thin Mints, mm -hmm. why not? All right. So that's probably good. And you want that, you can pick how much. Okay, already. Until it's even. Once that's done, you have your next layer, which is chocolate ice cream. Okay. And we've already let this soften. And I'll let you spread that if you'd like. And you can All right. Soon. Just out in another even layer across so the top. So just an even yep. layer. So a big thing on top and then just kind of spread it yes, out? Yes, just kind of spread it out. Alrighty. Okay, so yep. we would spread. So let's so pretend that this is yes. spread so nice while and pretty. That's being spread nice and evenly and mm -hmm. getting pretty. Um, you can have your Cool Whip or whipped cream out and ready to go on top. And okay. what that's going to do is that's going to give you that really, really pretty layer you see there yeah, on the okay. finished product. Alrighty. And you can lay out some uncrushed uh, thin mints on top of that as kind of a decorative mm -hmm. topping. And it's a really, really delicious dessert. It's one that I've made myself. Oh, have you? Okay. I have, yeah. So who made, did you make this one? Or did you get a little help on that one? I got a little bit of help on that one. Uh -huh. Yes. Um, All right. But I have another one in my freezer at the house that I made on my own. Okay. All right. So we, there is the finished yes, product right there. Make. And we've got some of the other cookie deals. So the number yes. one seller is... Is your Thin Mints, thin which mints. is what we're using here. Okay. And then number two number is... Number two is the Samoas, Samoas, which are your coconut and chocolate cookie. Okay. And then my favorites are also over there, which are the trefoils. Those are your original. See, that's original. me. I'm the simple yes. one. Yes. All right. I, I, to me, I can't do chocolate right. and, 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 and mint. It just, for me, the mint contaminates the chocolate. Mm -hmm. But I love this. Yes. You know what I do? What? My mama did this when I was a kid. Mm -hmm. This shortbread and a layer of cheese. Ooh. Nice little snack. Sounds delicious. All right. So, <laughs> Meryl's not so sure about that. <laughs> Shout out to the school that you're at? At University School of Nashville. Recipe yes. number 5477. It's available online at newschannel5.com. To locate a cookie booth in your area, go to girlscouts.org. Thank you very much for being Thank with you. us today.